Hi there guys, it's Lovey Boy 263 here. Welcome to Football's a Pitch episode 62. And today Livingston welcome Rangers to the Tony Macron Arena. Now today is a Sunday kickoff live in Sky Sports. These are the games that as a Livingston fan you get excited for. The games against Celtic Rangers Hearts, as I mentioned this in my Hibs vlog, these are the games you get excited for and hope that the Lions can get anything out of the game. If we get a point today, it's been an amazing day. But today Livingston welcome Steven Gerrard's side. This is going to be... I think it's going to be quite a close game because Rangers are currently 4th in the league as it stands. They've had a very good start. Not amazing by their standard, but for a Scottish team they've had a good start. Although Rangers are struggling to get points on the road now, so hopefully Livingston can take advantage of that. As for Livingston, we're currently 6th. We have had an amazing start. Considering where you'd expect us to be, you'd expect us to be at the lower end of the table with Dundee, Mullerwell and all that, but... We are currently up there in the top six and how long will it last? I don't know but hopefully we can grind out a result today because we are the only team in the league to take points off hearts so we can take big games and we can play under pressure as you've seen against Hibs and you've seen against hearts so it's definitely going to be an interesting game. Score prediction, I'm convinced it's going to be 2-1 today, I just don't know if it'll be 2-1 Rangers or 2-1 Livingston but whatever happens, I hope you enjoy my video, come on Livingston, let's defy the odds today and get a shocking three points. Somebody back off the ball. And surely Christ, you can for going to don't know. And surely Christ, you can for going to don't know. Should tell me you're throwing a bounce ball. Oh, man. 
What a result for Livingston. It's going to take ages to wipe the smile off my face. I am delighted with that result. That meant so much to Livingston. For f many reasons. A. Livingston are third in the Premier League. We're in a European position as it stands. B. Hamilton and Dundee are going to struggle to get points off Rangers. See if it comes to a relegation battle, which let's face it and be realistic, it probably will. That's points that Hamilton and Dundee won't get. So I'm delighted with that result today. As for the game itself, I think we were the better team. Rangers had more possession, but... Our chances were more clear cut. I think Livingston did deserve all three points today. Normally I sit here and beat ourselves up, but I think we were the better team today. Dolly Menga. He's not scored for Livingston. He's played really well for Livingston, you can't lie, but that goal today, that goal meant so much. So well done, Dolly Menga. What a finish right through the legs of the keeper. Amazing. As for the Rangers fans, first of all, it was amazing to go to a sold out game at the Tony Macron Arena. It was amazing to see all four stands in Houston. Yes, three stands then were Rangers fans, but it's always good to see a big game and lots of atmosphere. The bad thing that let Rangers fans down was the fact that the linesman got struck with a coin. I don't care if you're Rangers, Celtic, Livingston, Dundee, Dundee United, Brecon, East Fife. I don't care what level of the game you're at, what team you're at. Throwing objects at officials is wrong and shouldn't happen. But Livingston did get the three points today. There was a bit of a scrap on the field with Gallagher and Andy Halliday and a few of the Rangers and Livingston players, but sometimes high emotions in a game like that, some people can't accept defeat, and that's just the way of the world. But anyway, guys, I do hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Livingston are currently high flying right now. How long will it last? Don't know. Hopefully it'll go all the way. I doubt it will, though. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Please go into the like and subscribe, and Livingston are on their way. Well done, Livy.